What's up, JKationers? Welcome to the live stream. We'll be starting up in just a couple of minutes, so sit back, grab yourself a snack and drink, and let's get ready to explore. Before we begin, comment where in the world you are watching from. Say hello to everyone in the chat as us Jcationers are a fun, positive, and no drama filled stream. If you're not subscribed yet, please consider it as you won't be disappointed. The live stream will begin in just a few seconds, but before we start, make sure you smash that like button. It really helps the video get shown to the world. Finally, make sure to read the rules of our stream in the description box and say hello to our friendly Jcation Mod Squad. They're gonna make sure that the stream stays safe and on point. In just a few seconds, we shall begin. See you all soon, Jcationers! early man the sun has barely risen uh it's my final day in boracay and um i was actually unable to get a load for my for my internet my sim card so i ran out of internet and i got like bugs going up my leg right here so uh we're here in boracay philippines this is one of the nicest white sands beaches on the planet there's already a ton of people here taking pictures early in the morning and uh you know i was able to finally get some internet onto my phone so i said you know what we're only in Boracay for how long we might as well show you guys what's going on here during sunrise so roll call, we got TM, we got Andrew, Sebastian, Teresa, JP, Zach, Bear, Mom Food Plant Thing, Sinister, Juan, Chaos. It's so nice here. How you doing, Teresa? Has to pop in and out, no worries. No worries. Hello, Mitten, and your Kuya James. Nice, well, we got 55 people in here. Let's get that like count up. Let's take a walk. Walk it like a talk it. Let's go down the uh, White Sands Beach. So basically, you got this beautiful White Sands Beach. I'm gonna turn this around and say this. What's up, Jcation Nation? Welcome. Pet 75's in the house. See, I got my Baracai shirt going right now. Um, yeah, so sun just, has risen um i decided when i came here to baraka i was like i'm just gonna film i'm not gonna edit any videos i'm getting too into my too into my bag with editing so i was like yo i need a i need a break so i just filmed videos some so right now we're on so so this island this part of the island is consisted 
of four stations. All the way in the end is station X where the port is and that's where uh, the airport is on the other, on a other island. And then you got station X, then you got station three, station two, and then you got station one up this way. Station two is the most craziest out of all. Hey, what's up, uh, Fave? Favi? What's up, Liberty? Firestorm? Camusto Pares and Mars. What's up, Second to None? Christian Sandoval? Welcome, everybody. Hello, Jennifer. All right, so we got 77 people up in the house. Let's get that light count up. Thanks for watching. Yes, all the stores and the restaurants are over to the right. Oh man, during the day, it is so hot over here. But it's not every day you get to stream on the beach. <laughs> so why not? Let's, why not stream on the beach? Look at this. Once the sun's out though, oh my goodness, it's hot. Yeah, Zach, this is one of the most beautiful beaches in my opinion. There's a lot of people, way too many people here, but uh, even at six in the morning. Jerry Delira, what's up? Dadcation's in the house. Yeah, I woke up early. Look, it's 6.04 in the morning. See ya, Teresa. Pat75, you are such a degenerate, man. <laughs> Playing cards. Playing cards. <laughs> oh, I can hear the Tahoe. The, the people. See that? That's so Philippines, right? That's so Philippines right there. You can hear Tahoe. Tahoe is basically like... Uh, comes out of that pot over there this guy has. Alright, we have 88 peeps watching. Thanks for tuning in. It is a little windy today on this side. Uncle Jack Cation. What's up, Uncle Jack? So guess what, man? Fridays closed down during the pandemic. It's gone. And apparently they're building a new Fridays, but... Right now, it's all blocked off. I went there yesterday because I wanted to go to the restaurant and there was nothing. It was a wall saying Fridays will be back. Fridays is over in station one, which is down that way. And I was sweating. Walking here, if you walk here under the sun, it is beaming, guys. The sun is beaming. Same time zone in KL. And then the beach is so different now, look, like, because they closed down Barakai, and when the tide is low, it almost looks like a mini sandbar type. Hello, mom Cation. All right, we're nine minutes in. I could be on here for about an hour with you guys, but I wanted to show y'alls. It's not every day you're able to live stream on the beach. Efezi, what up? Need <laughs> I'm not missing that right now. I'll tell you that. Vegas will always be back be be, be there. It's time to do stuff differently. Just for a bit. What's up, Helder Webb? Shout out to mom food plant and things. So during the day when the sun is up, everybody lounges under these trees over here. And this is like a little uh, shade retreat for, for people in the middle of the day. But right now it's nice. Let's see, let's see what the weather is. Right now it is 78 degrees on White Beach. So, 
78 degrees. It'll get up to the 90s later on and then humid. I've, I've gone through so many shirts already. I had to wear the souvenir shirt that I bought here in Boracay. Tajo is fermented soybean. Mabuhay from the Philippines. Awesome, Adam. Thank you for the super chat, bro. Appreciate it. And we just hit over 100 people watching. Thanks for hanging with me on the beach. Hello, Lisa. Now you see like all this uh, green here. This is like green, like I think it's algae, some sort of seaweed. And uh, it washes ashore here on White Beach. It didn't used to be like this. Uncle Jack, we can still make a Jaycations over here. <laughs> this place over here is called Johnny's. This was a big party last night. I went here for happy hour. They had like a fiesta. They had a fiesta going on here last night. You'll see that on my video. Yeah, it's Friday right now. It's Friday morning. <clears throat> And up that way is the uh, the rock um, with the Virgin Mary up there. What's up, Nick S. DC Cueva? And you can see the main road right there. That's the actual main road of this island. <laughs> David, what's up? Have tons of fun there. Your wife is from Batangas. Nice. Batangueño. Batangueño. Shout out to Sunny June and Danny in Barcelona. They're all from Batangas. Uh, my, my roommates, my Barcelona familia. Yeah, Batangas is over. Um, not too far from Kabuya, where my mom is from. Well, they, they shut down, they shut down Boracay three, what, four years ago, five years ago, five or six years ago. So they might have to shut it down again if they want to clean up the algae. Oh yeah, and this is nothing right now. So this place right here has some of the best prawns ever. I remember coming here 12 years ago. And they have amazing prawns. This is a, it looks like Obama grill, but it's Bama grill. They call it Bama grill. They have a really nice happy hour here too. Basically their happy hours are buy one, take one from three to eight. So you can get a drink for about six or seven bucks but you get two of them i remember going to Boracay when i was a kid in 96 when my family spent christmas season in the philippines yep and Boracay was so different back then because i was i went to Boracay as a kid too in the mid 90s and uh this place was not like it is now wow there's so many walkers in the morning so i guess the time to get on the beach is before the sun because the sun rises over on the other side of the island and it sets on this side of the island. Connie Triplett says, have fun, I'm from that island. Nice. Yeah, not many people are from actual Boracay. So that's pretty cool. So we're gonna walk all the way to that rock and then I'll take you guys back. This place right here is called Parau. It used to be called Coco Mangas and that was the party club. This is, I guess this is the new party club but Coco Mangas used to make like these spoof NBA shirts and I used to get one every vacation. So I had one from like 2009. <laughs> I think I had one from 2013 too.
Uh, welcome everybody. We got 121 people watching. Just walking up and down the uh, station White Beach over here. Did we get a super chat from Bobble Bunny? Two pound Philip. Hope you're having a great time. Thanks, Bobble Bunny. Having an amazing time. Appreciate you, Bobble Bunny. What's up, Mickey? Check out Las Casas Filipinas de Azucar in Bataan. Nice. Go for the land tour. Yeah, I heard you can just get like a get a tricycle and rent it out and take a tour around it, around this area. Sky Gem, how you doing? Thank you for watching, I appreciate it. All right, we got 130 people, only 61 likes. Let's try to get it up to 100 likes here. I know some of y'all didn't hit that like button yet. Maraming salamat sa inyong lahat for watching. Dad Cajun could hear the taho. What's up, Tish? This is a beautiful beach, but this algae kind of messes it all up a little bit. But the water is great. Look at this, this guy got a clear kayak over there. And this is that uh, Virgin Mary, I think it's called Willie's Rock. That's it, Willie's Rock. This, this, this kind of like is the border to where station one begins. And then station one ends over by where that where you could see that little that big hill over there up front. Hi Luke. Yeah, we're on the island of Boracay right now. We're on Boracay Island. Hello from Anchorage, Alaska. Hi Patricia Moore. Welcome. Shout out to Alaska. You guys are getting my morning voice. <clears throat> yeah, I woke up at five made sure everything's packed because I need to be out of my hotel um, by like 7.30. So I can only be live for an hour. <laughs> so once it hits 7, I gotta, I gotta shower and finish all the packing and then hop my, hop my transport to the airport and get back to Manila for the final leg of this Philippines trip. So, yeah, it's actually gone by pretty fast. My parents were telling me, my parents were telling me that uh, <laughs> the time I'm spending here is way too short. And I was like, no way, no way. That's more than enough time. Nope, I probably want, I, I probably could have stayed here for a couple more weeks, like two more weeks. Well, here you go, guys. This is Willie's Rock. Uh, Luke, we're going back to Manila. Back to Manila and then Korea on the way. So the next time you'll probably see me streaming is in Seoul, Korea. That is Willie's Rock right there. Let's, let's zoom in. See, there's like the Virgin Mary over there.
Patricia is asking if I went to Shargao. Well, I was going, I, I was invited to go to Shargao. Um, I would have had my accommodations all taken care of. I have a friend that has a place over there, but the flights were are, are ridiculous from Manila. Like it was like $300 round trip to Manila, from Manila and, and and that and like Shargao is already in Mindanao, all uh, like to the. It's just it's south, <laughs> and and if you don't take a direct flight there, you have to go through Cebu, and it takes longer than it really should. Yeah, internet's pretty good at the beach, Uncle Jack. So over this way is the station. The nicer resorts are over this way. Um, I ate dinner here last night in this hut up there on the third floor. It's called uh, Back Beach Burgers. It was okay. It was okay. You'll just get it down to one table. <laughs> yeah, let's walk along the beach. I was gonna walk us along the side here. See, the sun's gonna start peeking up here. And then it's gonna get even hotter. Yeah, Shargao, if, you're, if you wanna take a boat or fly from Cebu, it's cheaper. But from Manila, if you want to get there direct, you have to pay the price. What's up, Tony Jazz? Look at this dude right here running on the, uh, he's running on the sand part. Like it's almost like a sandbar. People are walking on the sandbar right now. All right, 150 people, welcome. Get my Manapono hat on. I'm getting a head start on my, uh, on my summer tan here too. Yeah, they redid everything, but the the algae and the, uh, creep back. <laughs> yeah, it's crazy here. I mean, think about it later on in the day. You know, people are trying to get out here early in the morning while it's not crazy hot because once it starts like, like one o'clock, two o'clock, dude, it is hot. It is fuego up in this beach. What's up, James Crabble? Yeah, thank you. Hit that like button, please. Mike Gordon, what's up, Mike? Ah, oh, thanks, Mike, for the four ninety nine fill up. I appreciate that, man. Shout out to Mike Gordon. Always been a supporter on the channel. Much love. All right, eighty nine likes. We're almost. At, we're almost at that hundred. Uh oh, internet. Right, internet's kind of going up and down. Let's go walk towards D Mall. Trisha Moore. Oh, Tony Jazz with the 499 super sticker. Thank you, Tony Jazz. Shout out to Tony Jazz and Mike Gordon. Thank you. That really helps. Um, Patricia, going to Vegas Monday for a week. Can't wait to get out of this weather. 120 inches of snow this year. Holy moly. What's up, Kevin? What's up, Hex Fetty? Hex Fetty? So over here, there's a few more restaurants. This is Sunnyside Cafe, right next to Parau, which is like the, the beach club party. It used to be Cocomungas back in the day.
All right. Alan, the green algae will become a white sand eventually. <laughs> Murakami, what's up Murakami? It snowed a little bit. <laughs> Uncle Jackation knows what's up. <laughs> Uncle Uncle Jack, uh we went here on a boys trip in 2009 with Uncle Jackation and my best friend Jason. And uh, we stayed here uh, at Friday's Barakai. I have home video of that whole thing. That was like my, my OG vlogs back in 2009. There's a DVD out there. It's a three-part DVD with... This is pre jcation It wasn't even called jcation yet. <laughs> Not even uploaded online. They're DVDs, but they're edited videos. They even have like disc menus and everything. So one of my OG videos, not even YouTube videos, just vi OG like homemade edited videos um, was from Barakai. <laughs> What's for breakfast? I actually don't think I'm gonna have breakfast today. Um, my flight's at, uh, my flight is early so I'm probably going to eat lunch when I get to Manila. I'll probably be hungry by then. I've been eating non-stop. I don't usually eat breakfast and I've had breakfast the last couple days here. Oh man, Friday's was five star and now it's gone. It's gone. Well, it will be back. It looks like they're rebuilding it, but they tore down everything. So it looks like it's going to be a while until Friday's opens but I did stay in the other side of the island um, two nights ago the windward side I guess you could call it well it's the windy side of the island at least and uh, it's more of how Baraka used to be the the beach is a lot smaller but there is barely any people on that side of the island Uncle Jack got his Paddy Diver Certificate. Yep, you did. You got your uh, Diver Certification here. I remember that. What's up, Neil? I appreciate you, Neil Macedo. Shout out to Neil. Big J Cation Nation supporter from Melbourne. Yeah, internet's actually holding up pretty nicely over here, guys. But I'll take you guys into the popular area called D Mall. This is station two. Um, yeah, we're still in station. We're moving back up towards station two, down to station three, and now there's a station X too. And then that's Kateklan, Kalibo, that is a separate separate island down the way there. Barakai ends over at that tip. Neil's watching Dune 2. Nice. Nice man. Treat yourself. Enjoy Zendaya. Zendaya. Tomato. Tomata. Hey, we just hit over a hundred. Thanks guys. Yeah, I barely had coffee this morning, so I'm still talking in a lower octave. <laughs> My motor doesn't start running. It doesn't start running until about 10 o'clock. Carol Chung, how you doing? Safe travel, love traveling with you to the Philippines. Thank you. Yeah, um, when I got here, I started doing like dailies almost daily videos but uh when when you start traveling to places like this you kind of like i was like well should i be sitting in my room editing or should i actually explore and i, I chose exploring <laughs> so you'll see these videos a little later on once i get back i'm gonna do the same thing in korea korea is gonna be uh more exploring
Yeah, Shangri-La is actually on the other side of this. Shangri-La is more of a private. And Shangri-La is like, I don't know, $800 a night. This is probably $600 a night. It's like Disney Aulani prices. Welcome to all 136 of y'all. We're here in Boracay, Philippines. And we are gonna walk to an area called D Mall. D Mall, like the letter D Mall. And D Mall has restaurants and everything. Winter in December was great. Here in the Philippines? Is there coconuts on those palm trees? There's coconuts on some of these trees. I do see them. I do see coconuts up, up there. We are not editing, we are partying. <laughs> One of the famous quotes from the Lambanog maker here in the Philippines on the show, Three Sheets. This old guy, he was serving the host, Zane Lamprey, Lambanog, which is like almost 150 proof straight gasoline alcohol. And he's like, you are not dying. You are partying. And that's one of the most famous quotes that came from that show. Hey, Angela. Ganda naman dyan, yeah. Ooh, got a little bit of that breeze too. Nice little cool breeze. Yeah, everybody's enjoying this like sandbar. Because once the tide rises, the, the water comes up to like almost here. What's up, Rick Miller? Yeah, it's beautiful over here. So all the restaurants and stuff are still closed. The original Ditali Tapa. Yeah, Ditali Tapa. I remember that place. Came when uh, I was here with my parents in the 90s. So, places open around 10 or 11, but the hotel breakfast spots start opening around 6. Uh, people are actually going on runs. I like those uh, clear plexiglass sup boards and kayaks. It's pretty cool. Yeah, Baraka is amazing. Well, 6.30. So I said I'll be with you guys for an hour. So, uh, about 27 more minutes. All right, 160 people in the house. Let's hit that like button. Let's get more people in here. Let's try to get the 200 hanging on the beach. I'll have a video for you guys tomorrow. It's a Vegas video. So stay tuned. It's uh what's it like staying in Las Vegas? Uh what's it like staying in Caesar's Palace, Las Vegas in 2024? So stay tuned for that. I stayed there back during the knitting convention. Oh man, I have so many backlog Vegas videos that I planned on releasing during this trip but I didn't end up releasing. <laughs> that will help me in the future though. I needed a backlog of Vegas videos. See like right now, Starbucks is just opening. There's a Jerry's Grill. Jerry's Grill kind of disappointed me. I had it.
Yeah, I thought I saw you on Mom Duty's channel. Was it on their channel? They were on my channel. I don't know if I put them. They were on my channel. I don't think I they recorded me yet. But we're supposed to have a collab. We're supposed to collab before I leave. Oh, I bought it's a Ube liqueur. Oh yeah, I brought I brought I'm bringing home a bottle. The Ube liqueur is amazing. I had to bring home a bottle of that. I got it over at the Manila Gin Festival. It um yeah, it's good. I'll I'll mix you up a, a a drink, Uncle Jack, when I get home. Uh, and then they it, it comes with. Uh, I also bought a rum called Canto. It's like a caramel, salted caramel rum. It's really good. AG, it's ultra maganda. There it is. It is. So all the shops are starting to open. I'm surprised that. Uh, oh well, it's only 6:33 in the morning. Oh, there's the. Here comes the sun, little darling. Here comes the sun. And once that sun is out, oh man, I am not gonna be walking around here. My phone would probably overheat walking in the sun. So this is probably the only time you can. Um, stream here because my phone would definitely overheat if it's blaring in the sun ube gin is delicious yeah i got well it was ube it's ube liqueur oh and here's my hotel that i stayed in night one i'm not staying at this hotel anymore but night one i was here this is the henin crystal sands they have a morning breakfast buffet and it's an it's a freaking lavish buffet guys and then up there upstairs you see where that dude is walking that's their infinity pool all right I'll climb up Ugh. so that's the crystal sands I actually got to walk here later on this is where I'm gonna catch my uh, catch my shuttle. Yeah, so Henin Crystal Sands, really nice hotel. Wait till you see the review. Uh, what's the cost of the night for a hotel? You could stay here for anywhere from fifty to six hundred bucks. Um, I actually recommend this hotel, Crystal Sands. You could stay there for as low as 7,000 pesos. But if you want the really nice room, it's about 13,000 pesos. Yep, here comes the sun. So we're walking here towards uh, D-Mall. D Mall has all the shops and all the restaurants. Oh, Carol Chung, thank you so much for the 1999 super sticker. That really means a lot. Thank you, Carol. Much love to you. Appreciate, appreciate you. Yeah, you could stay at a really nice hotel here or a really cheap accommodation if you want. They have hostels and everything here. This place is, oh, this place has fire shows. Everybody thank Carol. Much love to Carol, look at this. I love seeing these types of signs. So Red, Red Coconut, they have a fire show here every night. Every time I pass by here, there's a fire show going on.
what's up? 176 people now. We're about to get to the 200 mark here. We're almost to D Mall. Like I said, it's literally called the letter D Mall. D Mall. Aloha, Carol. Thank you. Oh man, and I still have my Hawaii series that I need to put out. I have a lot of sorting out of footage to do. We filmed about seven videos in Hawaii, in Oahu. Mainly food videos. We're going on a big diet when I get home. It's gonna be gym diet, gym diet. But day one, I need a California burrito. First thing I need to eat when I get home is a Cali burrito. Then we'll diet. Here it is, D Mall. All right, so we're inside D Mall. Good morning. This is Andox straight ahead. It's like a uh, chicken spot. It's actually not bad. It was okay. I had it last night. I was always interested in trying Andox. It was pretty cheap. Can I swim? I can swim. I've been swimming in the pools. Not in the water though. Not in the actual Philippines water. Teresa's back. So I'm gonna be on for another 20 minutes. And then we're gonna call this. But during the day, this is all on. So I ate here and docks last night. It's almost like a, it's like a mix of, it's like a, I wouldn't call it a Jollibee. It's, it's more, it leans more towards like a Popeye's KFC type place. This stream has been brought to you by the letter D. <laughs> and then I ended up going to the Hobbit bar. They used to call it something else back in the day. where all the uh it's just just like they call it it's called the hobbit bar so that explains the type of servers you'll be getting here at the hobbit bar it says dogs and cats welcome there's so many cats around here a lot of pusa what up latrus i call you latrus because he's for reals See, I, it's all, it's, I'm backwards right now because I'm half awake. <laughs> What's the plan for the whole day? Well, I'm traveling back to Manila. So, traveling back to Manila and I have a special collab that I'll, I'm filming with another YouTube channel. They're based out of BGC. Yeah, Scott, I'm actually staying in BGC. I've been staying there for the most most of the month. Uh, if you watch my videos, my past videos, you'll see. So everything's still closed. I think this doesn't open till like nine and it's not even seven yet. So all these places here are still shut. Teresa says, Dave says, hey, what up, Dave? Yeah, you and Teresa need to make a trip over here to the Philippines. <sighs> so everything's still closed around here. Well, I'm going to show you guys the main road here real quick. So, little doggies running around here. Little doggies. Doggies. Yeah, 6.30 in the morning. These places will be open in about two or three hours. But during the day, loud music and pretty much a party over here. Foot, footsies, footsies. Massage, reflexology spot. All right, we, we just reached 200 people. Thanks for watching. 
What's better, Palawan or Boracay? Well, it depends. Boracay is more of your concentrated, uh, you get the concentrated white beach. You don't have to travel that far for excursions. Uh, Palawan is huge. So there's El Nido, one side of the island. Then you got Puerto Princesa on the other side of the island. Then you got Coron, which is another island which you have to fly into. So it really depends on what you want to do. Like Palawan in itself is like a, could be a five to seven day trip. Boracay, you could stay here for four days and just relax. And it's more of a party, party area. So this is the main road right here. And you got your trikes. So you can you can rent these trikes out for like 50 to 100 to 200 pesos and get around the island. <laughs> Budget Mart. And that's D Mall right there. Uh, Boracay. Boracay. So here's your makdu. You can get your chicken makdu here. What's up, Yance? What up, Billy Bob? There's a little ATM right here. Where is that area? See you, Mom Cation. Talk to you later. I gotta walk back towards my hotel now as my time is running down. Oh, this is the Grand Boracay Resort over here. Okay. We just got to go back. Yeah, walking back through D Mall. Alright guys, let's try to get the 200 likes. We got 200 people watching. We can get 200 likes in this stream. Look at that. Chicken McDo. Chicken McDo. Where am I staying? I'm staying here in Station 2. I was at Henan Crystal Sands my first night. Then I stayed at a place called Savoy Hotel in uh, Boracay New Coast. Oh, this is the heaviest tourist area right here. Oh yeah. When it's not, when it's not six in the morning, most of the day it's crowded, but it does get pretty hot over here. Fort Wayne fella, yep. The McDo, the Mickey Doos. They call it Makdut here in the Philippines. All right, welcome guys. Thanks for all the love. 260 y'all in here right now. I'm so glad uh, uh, these two ladies at the uh, shop were able to load my internet here. And it was only like two bucks. And I was able to get the stream going because yesterday my my SIM card was done for. <laughs> I emptied the. Uh, 
Oh man, I, I walked by Discovery Shores, uh, Jeffrey, and uh, it's pretty nice, but it was like 400 bucks a night to stay there. Yeah, welcome to the channel, Kelly. Hello, Papot. Good morning, Idol. This place has, a gr has great desserts. Pinoy Dessert Bar. They have some Halo Halo, some Ube desserts. It's so good. What's up, Kevin Albert Leo? I should have shown you Makda. Well, it's Makda is Makda. <laughs> I did have a Jollibee Ube cheese pie. Oh, there's a kid. Hey, get it, get it, get it, get it. Hey, get it, get it, get it, get it. Wow, we're up to 261 people now. Thank you guys for watching. It's Thursday afternoon. So early tomorrow, Pacific time, you will see a Las Vegas video. And people will still be confused thinking that, oh, yeah, I thought you were in the Philippines. <laughs> but uh, it's a video I filmed back uh, during the knitting convention. Right. Man, this place was good. I tried this spot, Ube Mama. My goodness. Oh, and while I have all y'all's on here, if you guys haven't followed me on my Instagram yet, I, I have been posting daily stories on my Instagram. So uh, if you guys wanna check out my IG, it's Jcation TV. If you haven't followed me yet. More knitters. Oh, I have another video <laughs> from day two of the knitting convention. I haven't put that out yet either. So stay tuned. You have some Langonisa. Oh, I had that, yes, two days ago. Mainit is starting to get a little Mainit. You stay confused, no biggie. <laughs> Over here, you can buy Pasalubong, you can buy Sandos and stuff. I bought my the shirt I'm wearing over here for 200 pesos, less than four bucks. Actually, I think I bought it from this store. Yeah, I bought it from this store. This shirt. The Rock Eye Beach Party is back after six years. Yeah, I haven't been back here in 12 years. That place is called Aria Gelato. I had ube ice cream from there last night. What's up, Cafe de Soiree? How you doing? Thanks for joining. Yeah, I still have one video from the knitting convention that I need to post still. <laughs> I still have my WWE video I need to post too. There's the Tahok guy right there. All right, now back out to the beach. 651. The sun's out almost. What's up, Kiki? Are you with me? Kelly says your coworker just got back from Baraka. She's, she's Filipino. Nice. Oh, you can see the sun starting to peek out there. See that? The sun is coming. Maruno ako magtagalog, mabagal lang magtagalog, but nakaka intindi ako, so nagtaka nagtatagalog ako dito. There's your answer. Yes, I speak Tagalog. I am good, Kiki. Can't complain. We're here in the White Sands Beach in the Philippines. We're in the Peens. People are still running too. I was running. Hello. Everybody's hanging by the sandbar area here right now. 
Hello. Good day. Teresa with the 9.99 fill up. Thank you, Teresa. Turn down. Thanks, Teresa. Shout out to you. That shock is Hawaii, but that's worldwide right there. All right, can we get to 200 likes before this is over? You got about five minutes left onto the stream here. Here comes the sun, little darling. Sun setting in the East Coast, yeah, sun rising here. And all these people getting picks in. Aloha, Danica, what's up? So here's Henan Crystal Sands, beautiful resort. This was my favorite. Uncle Jack says knitter. Lexi Lore was hanging out with Lacey Lennon. Yeah, Lacey. Shout out to Lacey. One of the goat knitters. Beautiful shout out from Sacramento. Shout out to Sac Town. Mike, what's up, Mike OR Dubs? What up? Oh, that breeze is nice. You stop playing cards right when I'm about to end this trip? Bro Mart says, wow, you're in my Baraka. Baraka, my favorite place. Nice. It's one of my favorite places too. Look at that. Baraka surfboard. What's up, Ira Manessis? Manessis? Jason Barnes, sunny here in Pasadena, but had crazy Santa Ana winds earlier. Santa Ana winds. You have been getting the links down. Hey, what's up, The Oracle? The Oracle? I thought it was Theo. The Oracle, one, two, three. What up, The Oracle? All right, we're almost there. 15 likes away, guys. We got about two to four minutes left on the stream. Oh, man, it's nice out here. I'm glad I woke up early to stream. You get a little time on your own here. There is lots of algae. Um, right now it's not hot, but yeah, it gets hot during midday. Especially when the sun comes over on the other side from the other side of the island. It starts blaring down on you. The Oracle says flying out to Barakai from the UK in three days. Nice. That's awesome. I met a couple of uh fellas from the UK over here. Nice dudes. Shout out to the fellas in the UK, from the UK, John and Tom. Try all the sports activities, be safe. Yeah, if I was with a group, I would. Am I gonna travel to Shargau? I wish, I just didn't have time. I ran out of time. How's the food? The food is amazing. But BGC, man, next level international stuff. Food here in Baraka has been, uh, it's been all right. It hasn't been the greatest, but the food in Manila though, man. Am I ready to go home? Not quite, not quite. I actually would have liked to stay here for a couple more weeks. All right, we just hit that hour mark. Ch 
should we wait till we hit the 200 like market for me to log off because i gotta get going i gotta shower i gotta i gotta get over to another hotel cafe de soir we're in boracay philippines all right go thanks guys for watching much love yeah i'm on a quick schedule here so uh I got to pack, I got to shower, and then uh, head over to my shuttle to the airport. So um, thank you guys. Thanks for the super chats. Thanks for all the comments and keeping me entertained. And uh, I will be live in another country next, and it will be cold. It won't be hot. So <laughs> stay tuned for that. Uh, that's coming sometime next week. I'll be live. I got to get a SIM card when I get to that country, Korea. So Anong Hasayo. I don't even know. I don't even know how to speak Korean, guys. This is going to be crazy. But thank you, guys. Like, comment, subscribe. Appreciate it. Shout out to Teresa. Shout out to Latrice. Shout out to uh, Pat75. What's up, Angela? Thanks to all my mods. Jcation Nation. Till the, till the next one. Stay traveling. I'm Abuhai. And thank you for following me on my Philippine series. I have many more videos to come. See you, guys.